Hey, what's up, guys? This is Woody Geek. Welcome back to some more Pokemon Silver Bug Only Run. This is the Kanto half. Well, the start of the Kanto half, rather. To start things off, let's talk to Elm, who called us as soon as we're as soon as we got back from our, to our house uh, from the SSN app. Uh, SSN Herb Derp. No, I meant from the Pokemon League. He gives you the SS ticket for the SS Aqua in Olivine in Olivine City to go to Kanto. Um, which is where the events of Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow took place. And, uh, as well as Fire Red, Leaf Green, and, uh, yeah. Etc, etc. You know all this already. So now we gotta go to Olivine City. I would cut this out. If I do decide to cut it out eventually, in the end, then you're not seeing this, but whatever. Uh, I have not done any leveling whatsoever. Um, mostly because I know how wimpy the, uh, gym leaders of Kanto are now that we've beat, uh, Johto. Um, well, the, the Pokemon League, rather. Um, like, for example, Lieutenant Surge, his most powerful Pokemon is a level 48, so... I shouldn't have that much trouble. Especially considering I have Heracross with Earthquake. Now, that's already pretty devastating, but against the Surge... He doesn't stand a chance. So, uh, we're going to go with that. Do, 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 do. Didn't want to do that. Alright, first things we gotta do while, uh, well, when we get on the SS Aqua, I'm gonna talk about what we gotta do. But when we get to Kanto, I guess it, as we go along, we'll be fighting the gen leaders, but we will also firstly be getting through the main plot like the the reason we can't take on every gym leader at once is because Snorlax is in the way of uh, Diglett's cave so we can't go take down Brock immediately rather we gotta get um, the poker flute channel on the radio but we don't have the radio card and the radio and the radio tower is out of service mostly because it had a there was a power outage at the power plant next to the rock tunnel so yeah, we gotta go to and fix the power plant, and then we'll be taking on, and then we'll be taking on all the rest of the gym leaders. I think we can get like four or five done immediately. Hey, I think we can take on four or five immediately, but then we gotta take on the rest after we do the power plant. Um, first things first, that guy who ran into us, he was wondering where his uh, daughter was, or granddaughter. Um, this is another side quest. This guy's looking for his, uh, comrade, who's hanging out somewhere. Where is that somewhere, you may ask? Right here. Um, who do we start with? You know what? Butterfree's our first, second to Francis, but he has, he's six levels lower, let's do it. Yeah, I'm a sailor, alright. I wasn't goofing off. This cabin was vacant, so I just took a quick nap. Ah, forget it, let's battle. He says next to the cup of coffee. Curse you! Slacking off job, that's my work, and I think you misspelled Stanley. See, look, the trainer's Pokemon here are pathetic compared to what you've already gone through. So if you want some training on some other Pokemon you haven't caught, like you haven't really had the time to train yet, this is a good like this is a good time to get them up up there in the levels. Also, if you want to go for an easy gym challenge that shouldn't be any threat whatsoever, considering her, their Pokemon are all low-leveled. Go to Janine, which is Koga's daughter, in Fuchsia City immediately. Because her highest level is 38, I think. Or 40. That's nothing compared to what you've already gone through. So, Janine is probably my, my first choice for being the easiest uh, gym leader in Kanto. But I'm going to go through them as I come across them. So my first one would probably be Surge, my second one would be Sabrina, third maybe Erica, and, and then we'll just go from there. But I'm planning on getting Erica as soon as I can because, like before anyone else, because Tochikasa really needs a grass move and Erica gives you um, Giga Drain. And Giga Drain is a pretty powerful grass type move at this, like in this game. So it also heals. And Tachikazo is in dire need of some move that takes advantage of its type. 
Especially considering we need to take on Misty as well later, so... I don't think Francis should be the only one who gets all the experience. Because, you know, Thunder Punch. Alright, this guy is now letting us by. That guy, I believe, is a trainer. We don't need to go down there. She's just hanging out. She might be a trainer, I don't know. Hey! We've been looking for you. Hi, will you play with me? Oh, Grandpa's worried about me? I have to go. I have to go find Grandpa. Grandpa, Grandpa! Here I am, I was playing with the captain and this guy. Alright, and Heart Gold Soul Silver, the remakes of this game. Or, Gold and Silver, rather. Uh, you have to actually play hide and seek with this girl, but of course we don't need to here. So here we are in Vermilion City, finally. Took long enough? God, it was only like five minutes. I was hoping he would step out of the way. Alright, Vermilion! You may recognize the music. If you do, you're awesome. Because this is the... The Kanto Half has awesome remixes of the first game. Coming up here, we see... Fat Tub of Lard. Alright. Can't go that way, Snorlax is blocking it. Time to take on Lieutenant Surge. And unlike the first game, you don't have to... Uh, do a whole sort of puzzles. So that's useful. Or helpful, or whatever full you want to be. But we need someone with Cup and or someone with Surf. Just to get across to his gym. Because now we have Surf, we don't need to go get cut from, uh... From, uh, the captain on the, on the SSN. So now we can go with Surf! Yay! If we can get it that early in the other game, I would have been very happy, but of, of course not. Alright, Tochikasa and One Hit Knockout are going to be our star players in this because they know ground moves. And electric types are only weak to ground, so... Oh, not to mention, Surge has five Pokemon, one of which is quadruply weak to, uh, ground. Let me just interrupt what I'm saying here to say, the, the trainer battle music in Kanto is freaking awesome. So much nostalgia. Alright. Yeah, he has five Pokemon, I think one or two of which are quadru quad weak to, gr to ground, so... Shouldn't be a problem. And if this Pikachu avoids, good. He's dead. Oh, I love this music. And the gym leader battle music, oh my god, don't get me started, awesome as well. Yes! Alrighty, sorry if I failed you to let Lint Surge, sir. So here's Surge, which I think we'll be taking on the next part. So, without further ado, time to fight this guy, as I said in the next part. What did I do that for? Whatever. This is Woody Geek. Hopefully you enjoyed this part. I'll see you guys later.